in my previous bed logging video, which can be found here, people had left questions in the comments wondering about certain aspects of bed logging that I didn't cover in that video. So we're going to revisit the topic and I'm going to test to find out the answers to those questions. Giz of War left a comment stating that they weren't able to get bed logging to work in the Carrick. Here we are in space, and we're going to find out if we can indeed bed log in the Carrick. We need to make sure that we lay down and not sit. At first, there's the far away get up, which doesn't give you any other option when you hold down F. If you right click, the only option is to get up. However, I think I saw. Yeah, there we go. There's a closer get up. Even though holding down F does not provide the wheel, if we right click. Ah, there we go. There's the log out. Now let's see if it worked. And indeed, we woke up in the Carrick. I think the biggest problem here is that there's two interactable buttons. I believe that if you choose to sit, this get up button is the farther away one that did not have the bed logging issue because you're sitting. So there's no reason to have it with the log out option. So I think that's what's going on with the Carrick. But we did successfully bed log. We're gonna knock out two questions in one go. I do apologize, I'm not sure if it's Fury 4 or if it's supposed to be Fury if, but they state that they're having some difficulties logging out inside the cutter. So we're gonna try each of the different variants to see if there's any wonkiness with any of them. As well, Strift104's question asked, what about items in the vehicle inventory? Do they remain when you log back in? I have uh, risked a lot and spared no expense for this test. I have three medical gowns on board in the inventory right away i see the far get up button but if we move a little closer and hold down f there we go the second one shows up it's a little tricky but i've done this so many times i'm starting to get the hang of it and if i right click on this we have log out so let's do that now and now we'll head back in We have made it back in. Now let's check the inventory. And everything is still there. That is fantastic. We're just gonna quickly cut to the Scout and the Rambler to test those out now. Here we are in the Scout. And we have successfully returned in the Scout. Now for the Rambler. Now, here we are in the Rambler. Log back in. And once again, we are successful. Moving on to the next question. Blood Rush 25 wonders if the ship stays online after you log out or does it disappear? Nerdy Kitten here has been very gracious to help us with the testing. I am sitting here watching her ship now, and she is currently in bed, ready to log off. Nerdy, when you are ready, let us know when you're about to log off, and then do so, please. Let the experiment commence. I am now logging off. Oh, your ship immediately disappeared. And then let us know when you're about to log back in. Us? I'm in personality, so yeah. I'm logging in now. Excellent. And then if you could please let us know when you actually are able to move around. That way we could see if the ship appears. The ship has appeared. And I've loaded in the game. Okay. I'm getting out of bed. So the ship appears as soon as the servers recognize that you logged in, even if you are not able to move around yet. So there is a delay. Do you mind if I try another experiment here, Nerdy? Go ahead and get ready to bed log. I'm gonna fire one shot upon your ship because that might trigger some kind of difference with combat logging. Roger, my shields are up. Here I go, I'm, I'm gonna fire a volley upon you. Target friendly. Are you able to log off? Let me try. It doesn't look like I'm even in combat. Target friendly. 
Oh, I heard it hit my ship that time. Target friendly. Oh. Right. Oh, no, I cannot log out. It's grayed out and it says in combat. I am unable to log out. I will take a screenshot. Excellent. So do not log off. I'm going to come over there to do the next testing. BCX Halo Man wanted to know whether bed logging was available in a teammate's bed. For this test, Nerdy's going to see if she can log off while I'm in the ship, and then we'll see from my point of view what happens as well. Go ahead, Nerdy, and see if you can log off. Uh, it says log out ship has passengers. It is grayed out. Let me take a screenshot. Do you mind if I lay down and see what happens? Log out, do not own ship. If you own the ship, you cannot log off if someone else is on it. And if you don't own the ship, you at least currently are not able to log off in the bed. Drive and Nail 8551 states that you cannot have a vehicle on board that you do not own. Otherwise, you will not be able to bed log. Here we are on Lyria with our C1 Spirit. Nerdy is helping me once again. She is going to be spawning a ground vehicle and we will be testing if you can log out with the vehicle on. And then if we can't, which I believe that is the case, then we will disband the team and see if we can still not log out even though we are no longer partied. All right, here comes Nerdy now with her pulse bike. When you have a park, Nerdy, if you could please exit the ship. Okay, so we're gonna look into the cargo hold to confirm that there is a bike inside. We'll lie back down. Now we get the problem that it says unknown vehicle in ship. This shouldn't change anything, but Nerdy and I are gonna disband our group. And now, we still get the same issue. So they are correct. You cannot log off with someone else's vehicle inside your ship. At least for now, that wraps up all the questions that I had the ability to answer. Unfortunately, even with Invictus about, there were some ships that were mentioned in questions that I just could not get my hands on to test. That's a wrap for this video, and I will see you in the next one, adventurers. Bye bye